In the year 2000, if everything goes as planned, a time capsule will be dug up in Houston. Inside will be the predictions of over 20,000 students on what they think life will be like about that time in Houston and the United States. Today, that time capsule was buried. Inside were the predictions. It's all the idea of the Allstate Insurance Company marking the opening of their new building on Bel Air Boulevard. And here are some of the predictions from these students on what they think life will be like in the year 2000. Students who now range in age from 13 to 16. They believe that Houston will have a population of four and a half million. Freeways will be passe because everybody will have a flying saucer and they'll be visiting other planets with those flying saucers. Schools and study will be a thing of the past because brain waves will answer everything. Robot maids will take care of the housekeeping and the Boston robots will win the World Series. The twist will still endure as the favorite dance, but it will share the spotlight with something called the Holly Gully and the Majestic. There will still be a five-day work week, but you'll only have to work two hours a day. There's a wide range of ideas on salaries. One girl thinks she'll be making about a dollar and a half a year as a stenographer. A boy feels he'll be very disappointed if he's not making at least half a million dollars a year as an attorney. But if one prediction is to be believed, things won't change much around the White House because the president will be Caroline Kennedy. Lee Tucker, Channel 2 News, reporting.